I find. Hottest sound on the planet. This one straight to a boy neck. You better press it, no connect. Left boy a shake and a fret. I am P45 if you can it. <laughs> Fire red and dead. Me got London, best of British. <laughs> Simple. Tell the family how you came, how you came to start singing. Wow. Well, it's from me about ten years old. From my sister them, I'm a brother them. I'm growing up amongst good friends. So my daddy used to DJ. My daddy he used to DJ a lot of the time. But concert from me doing band. So then, I don't know, you tell about because we have famous people in the family also. Many different singers through the generations of music. Um, but it's have a passion for you. I don't know, it's like this, something about when we used to see them at DJ, like you or I, them, and even my uncle, them at DJ. So it started originally, them with. Okay, so, so what was your first experience of singing? I think it was at one of my auntie parties, something like that. You just jumped to the mic. Yeah, I just started eating some welly, you know? <laughs> then time we had a DJ, I'll give you more lyrics. So I even my own song, we had a DJ, you know? We had a DJ, you know? King yeah. Yellow Man, original King of the Dance Man. But we have the time, you know, we must start to be. You get me? <laughs> what was your first release and the name of your first album? 
My first release was called The Twang. The Twang? Yes, The Twang. It was on the London Jet Collection album, Music of Life Records. Simon Harris and Chris Friends. Me, Leslie Lyrics. Daddy Freddy, Liquid, Owe. So many different artists. That was my first to do with the album, compilation. Yeah. So that's my first experience. Yeah. And this was like, this was, wow, this was many, many years ago. So what year, did, so what year would you say you actually started professionally? 86. 86? Yeah. Okay. 86. Okay. What did your family feel about your career choice? Well, they didn't think it was a career. They looked at it as a hobby. But me, they said to myself, are you a business that? You get me? Because I don't see no one who's a doctor. Yeah. I don't see no liar. Yeah. Maybe liar, yeah. not liar. Yeah. You understand? So when you tell me for the one thing, I can't see what I do the next thing. And this makes me happy. And this is what I'm good at, also. OK, so how did you manage to get it to progress? Did you have support? Yeah, my mother used to support me still, you know, my gear that, you know, my mother. Mm -hmm. And my daddy used to look on it as a baby. Yeah. And he never debout all the while. So when he never debout of me, my brother or my elder brother, mm -hmm. he would have made sure, say, gang had a dance, they would have looked over me. A uh, rude boy, then he had a peck on there, so a guy can't touch this. Mm -hmm. You get me, sir? He just saw, he just look over me. So he's in the youth center then. Yeah. yeah. Who or what inspired you to write and who were your colleagues at the time? Well, my... Well, we used to have a song in Peckham, Peckham Park Road, called Shaolin Temple. Mm -hmm. Then we changed it to Musical Temple. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. And then Jabri's up to now, a Jabri's in there. Yeah. But then we used to have Wires in Young Lovers Delight. Mm -hmm. And they're youth man there. Mm -hmm. So my little bitch in them, you know? Then we had it. But then because of that, they'll be noticing Mellon Road, a DJ from Papalo. Yeah. Then I get to DJ on Vikings, that yeah. is Joe Bryan, yeah. and Senator Dixon, Philip Dixon. Yeah. From there, so now, Youthman promotion. Yeah. I buck up Daddy Freddy, Sugar Miner, Greta, Earl Miner, Simi, Sugar Miner, Love Me Out. Boom. Yeah. Start back with all, that's what we need. All of these Jamaican artists. Back every... pushing your foot through the door. Yes, man, as a British youth, bad British man, I said so. I must have got the youth talented and the brave. Mm -hmm. So, sugar, did love that. What do you tell the Firebird family the names of some of your hits? We have Little Bit Taller, mm -hmm. When Gone Papa, Upstairs She Goes, Back Way Talk, No Cocaine. A tune with me, Daddy Freddy, Pat Kelly, talking beatbox. Yeah. Me and Asha D on his still kicking album. It depends where your heart hits. The songs you've written. Yeah, well, well songs that written and, and up to now I'm still yeah. it's still beneficial to me. Yes, well some of them songs I've just mentioned. And there's so many others in different style of the music as well. Okay. Why is music important to you and what were your influences through your journey? But music is important, you know, because you see, word is power. It can be uplifting or it can be our downfall. Yeah. Me can take up the microphone and tell you they will shoot up the place. Yeah. Because they might listen to me, they might go shoot up the place. Yeah. Then when we tell them, don't shoot up the place. If they have any sense, they will listen to me and do not do that. Yeah. Yeah. So in other words, do as I say, don't do as I do. Has your career taken you around the world? And if so, where have you performed and what was your the most memorable place? It's taken me many, many countries around the world, honestly. Many. The name I tell us is so many different countries from all over Europe. I talk about me and a DJ just after the Berlin Wall, them times when I get licked up. Yeah, yeah. I do reggae music, me and Asha D and Freddie Lenny. Them times as a reggae artist. Remember, I dance all, you know, and I like reggae like Bob Marley, they were singing, and I sing me singing, and DJ, me a DJ. Yeah, yeah. So it's like Yellow Man and you Rai, them, and Papa San and them kind of artists. Yeah. But, but a different, you understand? I'm being a British artist also. Yeah. Not directly growing up in Jamaica doing reggae music, Britain. So even my 
musical heroes in Britain, Papa Levi, Tipper Eye, Smiley Culture, Arden Bay, Peter King, Colonel yeah. Sandy, yeah? Yeah. even me, DJ, and Coxon sound. Through Daddy Freddy, my teacher, my mentor, I end up with another mentor, the great tenor fly. Rest in peace, my brother. Yeah. Original tenor fly, Jonathan Sutton. Love and respect you for Ivan Ivan. Love you. Then we have with Top Cat too. So, Ricky Tuffy, rest in peace also. Gonna P, you promote, rest in peace also. I'm a great sugar man at the boss, the big chief, the almighty calling. Do all of, do all of the music. Army, and music from the Nobody at Japan. So, me are one of the last ones, and we still are kicking. You just named a lot of people. Did you do collaborations with some of these people? Yes. Our first Bogle show is me and Johnny Asbury and Reed. That's before Buja Bantandu, Batty Rider. Yeah. I am winning the Bogle. And me and Johnny Asbury and Reed first. I just show the links of the production. Yeah. And who's backing at the time. That's how Buja run with the theme man. Yeah. Because at the time when I done that, Color Man has got a song with Sugar Man on the same rhythm chart. Mm -hmm. Where me and Johnny Asbury has got both. And he's one, he's Kumina, real Kumina. He must sing in the traditional Kumina style. Remember, yeah. Bogle was a slave that rebelled. Yeah. I met the people them in the cane field, so we're not working them here. Because they have a slave, we are two. Or you can't give a machine. Yeah, give me some. 12 inch machine and I tell you if you do this and I beat you if you do that. So I'm just whispering, you, you don't know like a mutiny thing. Silent whispering, everybody get wicked, that's why Bogus are famous and we're there. Yeah. Would you mind sharing the current struggle recording artist's main face? A little prejudice. Even as a British artist. Before they boost me, they prefer to boost the Jamaican artists. Them times is not as good as me. Yeah. But the cause of the stigma of the whole thing. You understand? Look how big some of the some reggae artists, British artists are. And they're not Jamaica. Yeah. Smile. Generally. You do the man. Yeah. But it's not where you come from or where your body is, it's where you can do. So that's what I feel. I feel like the, the prejudice against me. Because I am not directly born in Jamaica. You can't tell me that. When we go in my front door, my in my mother house, that's a Jamaica. Me that school monks pure white people every day. When we go in my house, a Jamaica that. When we wake up on Sunday morning, I have to sweep stairs, I have to do this, I have to do that. Same thing when we have to do Jamaica, I have to do the same thing. As boy pick me, you have to learn to cook, wash your own clothes. My mother tell me, don't make no woman come take care of food. If she don't want to cook, that's a fear busy. Don't sit down there and let me go. And we had the same dirty pants every day. Rinse out your thing then. The only thing you need woman for is obviously the obvious. Yeah. And about, to bring forth. What about things like hiring halls and getting locations to have like events? I it's not something that I personally really No, but how do you think we it would feel for people like us? Getting an event a place for you to 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 perform. It's hard. It's hard. It's hard at the moment. It's hard because there's no support, right? There's no support. If me, if that can share the family as a friend, I keep something. And the family told me I say, well, I keep something. Yes, who not ready for doing? Go next go go get Bricks and Academy. Yeah. It's true. It's true. Go next go go get it. The mama said, yeah, come check me tomorrow. Tomorrow I never come. Yeah. Although we've been into it, even the artists that we're talking, I say, you know what I'm saying, we'll do this for free. And even while I want to pay with just get the place and make it just rise up the thing. Still, they're about, what's if the artists they're going to do it for free? They're about to and I say, yeah. Some, them all flood the place themselves. Yeah. Just so nothing will go on. They will turn on the tap them overnight. And flood it, just so nothing will go on. Remember that. If you could give advice to an aspiring artist, what would it be? Keep your thing real. Keep it real. You see, you can do it for the love, or you can't do it for, you can do it for the like. You can do it for the love and for the liking. Some of them say they do it for the love and not for the like. Yeah. It not make you do something if you not like it. 
If you don't like it, you don't, yes, love is one thing, but don't, if you don't like it, we are doing it for you, you're it to yourself. You're not being fair to yourself. I don't like doing it, but me are doing it. Don't do it. But, back to the question where you asked me. Talk constructiveness. Be true to yourself. Try to get everybody where they want. So that's why I'm glad, because me can deal about any kind of reggae. You know, see how reggae music is great. Everything come out of reggae music. Listen to all the music nowadays. Could that dog step, or could that up step, down step, through the road step. No matter which step you are, step, a reggae step. A reggae come from a rasta step. When you hear that, our heart beat. So far right, it's a rasta step. You can't get nothing more than that. No matter where you want to use it, you can use it and do whatever you want to do. But it's still, although we're not taking the blame. So if you have to do the wrong thing. Yeah. But that's where it comes from. What artists do you listen to? All different types. Every. It depends what mood I'm in. So I want to listen to consciousness now. Like on a Sunday like this now. We would say them kind of style of music. We listen to Bob, we listen to Hep Tones, we listen to Deep Brown, we listen to Burning Spirit. Then later on, and after, uh, after we done cook now and said so that we can turn it up, pick up it now, I'm start again, I'm a Bailey, I'm a Stitch, I'm a Papa Sunday man. We're in my 90s era now. This is my daddy for them. I put out some cops and cassette with the water we are beating. Gappy Crucial and select, Black and Dead and select. Copper Youth, Steve the Culture, mix it. Danny Chemist. And then my dad back in the later on now, when he's wine long time now, we can listen to some lovely music like all these kind of lovers rock kind of style. And we just kick back. You see? What have you currently got in your pipeline? A woody, you know. Talk to us. We have some songs, then. A woody, man. Can it even make sense when I talk nothing? Because you see, you talk things. And it don't no, manifest. Oh, yes, a speech. But this I tell you, brothers, listen now. And let's know, say 2020. I really give really them, you know. Yeah. You get me? Yeah. And I'll be a constructiveness when I give them to them. I'm not in a idiot tune with them. And I'm mean, not going to boost up the gun thing until you use them. When you really want to use them, is, is cut down from the key. From the stabbing and the shooting. Let me tell you something. It now will stop. See? Not going to stop. No matter where anybody wants to say, it start long before me. And it will go down long before we pass as well. Yeah? I know we start this. All we have to do now is just try and just meditate and just hold a, 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 hold a strong meditation and try. Because remember, it's through many different reasons as well. Not always the aggressor is the wrong one. Yeah. Well, you could have wrong feeling, but nobody never see a wrong feeling. Yeah. But then they see me. You will react now. I mean, you look like the bad one. Why you react like that? What are you doing? Okay. But that's just one side of the script, one page of the script, so that's all I can say in that. Wow. How can the Firewood family keep in contact with you? Well, the Firewood family are my family, so that I didn't lease our okay. problem. You get me? I'm a mention here, Johnny Dalla, aka Ras Ras Dalla. See him? Love and respect you. G White, all the Remus family, them inspiration. Again, Viking, Papa Love. Who are the ones? I would have been able to call them. Same, Zizi, Japan, Toyo. Thank you. Okay, so, so where can we find you on Instagram? Oh, Facebook? you can get me on the Instagram. You can get me on Messenger. You can get me on WhatsApp. You can get me on Facebook. And is it Japan, or Toyo? No, you see, the thing is. Japrento is an extension of Prento you because I'm a big man, you know, I'm a yeah. grandfather. Yeah. But I will always be Jayu. Yeah. I use the creator. So yeah. as I said, Ja Prento you. Okay. So some people call me Ja Prento. Who oh, know me and the big man them still call me Prento you? Yeah. And it's a black agenda and yappy cool shall and them say Prento big man. <laughs> <laughs> you get me? It's gossip P, yeah. the producer yeah. from Fashion. It's gossip P called me Ja Prento. Okay. Yeah. He named you. Yeah, in common with your friend. That's the key. Your friend, your friend, your friend, your boss, your boss, your boss. I just show me a little bit of it. Please feel free to make a shout out to your well-wishes. Well, to everybody that has supported me through the years, regardless to the good or the bad 
rough and the you know, rough and smooth. I respect you and I thank you all. And I will keep up my mission. Because a mission needs a part. You know? Selling in brief way, all the Britons got reggae crew. We have to respect you, you know. Uh, I me mean, I'm one of the first artists them to do this thing. You see it? Respect you because you reach a long way. I'm respected for that. See? All the Uta that crew them, big it up. They don't know Mr. Robin, Javi Nation, they know how it up. But my original people them. My original foundation. See? You know who you is. Too many names to mention. But like Mr. Bits are kicking like about a 2020 are coming up. So 2020, that plenty. You see? Plenty, plenty. It has been an honor interviewing you. And on behalf of Five X Station, the Five X family, family, I want to say thank you. Bless you, Empress. I respect you. All of the fire family, them get done now. Similar money to the maximum. Yow, dark as shade. Just one kick it like a ball. Bend it like Beckham straight from Peckham. Simple. Zizzy. Japrenta, you would say. Mm -hmm. One up. Could we ask you to take this out with a big up of, it, of your... Sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, even when the phone rings as well. So, yeah. <laughs> Could we ask you to take us out with a big up to the hottest station on the planet, Fire Station? Well, this is the original shout and cute your friend to you. And when it comes to good music, you can't refuse it. Remember, a fire in station, you know. Yes, for that, they run the nation, you know. Sizzle, my time, my job, your friend to you. What well, is it like how this is the original shot and cute your friend and you? Fire Red Station, tell the whole of them said that to come to tell the nation. Tell the whole of them said that to come to preach the nation. Tell the whole of them said that to come to the nation. Bring to you to tell the Fire Red Station. Tell the whole of them said that to come to tell the nation. Tell the whole of them said that to come to preach the nation. Tell the whole of them said that to come to the nation. Fire Red Station. 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 Fire Red